What's going on, guys? It's your boy Prozidice, and I'm bringing another episode of Pokemon on the Board. In the last episode, we reached the Agate Circus. Um, we did pretty much all the puzzles except for one. I was trying to get that Timber puzzle, but I just couldn't figure it out for the life of me, so I skipped that puzzle for now. I'll probably do that in a later episode. Alright, so where we are right now, we're in the Agate Circus. Um, before we continue... Hey, I lost my parents. Hey, I lost my parents when the Gate City was shut down and I'm still all alone with no one to take care of me. It's making me real sad. So do you think you could cheer me up by going to get me some cotton candy? There we go. Wow, thank you, you're the best. I feel a lot less sad about the ultimate untimely demise of my parents now. This guy, this this boy is playing me. This boy's speaking way too smart. But I'm still kind of sad. You know what would make me less sad? A balloon. Balloons really lift the spirits. Hey, uh, would you get, go get me a balloon? Do I have one? I know how to get one. It's pretty easy. There we go. Yeah, <laughs> I believe it's a one hundred percent doctor approved. <laughs> there we go. Balloon. Oh my God! Really? You're so cool. Yay! This balloon is the funnest. I don't think we forget all about how I never see my parents or any of my family ever again. Oh, now I'm thinking about that. I feel really lonely. Hey, you know what would make me feel less lonely? If you bought me a Poké Doll from the High Striker. I know I couldn't win it, but you could. And that would stop me from crying myself to sleep every night. <laughs> there we go. Yay, you're the coolest. But you know what's even cooler? Ice cream! You know, I haven't had ice cream since my dom disappeared in. There you are, sweetie. I've been looking all over for you. Um, hi, Mom. It's, uh, been a while. What are you talking about? It's only been a little bit since you demanded I go off and buy the candy you wanted. Wait a second. You're acting suspicious again. <laughs> Young man, what have I told you? What have I told you about extorting strangers? Only do it to people who look like jerks. <laughs> That's right. And this person seemed like a nice respectful young trainer. Again, that's it. You're grounded. Sorry for the hassle. My son could get a little out of hand sometimes. Why don't you take this as an apology? And another department store sticker. So, no ice cream? Fine. <laughs> Your father will hear about this. <laughs> Ridiculous, man. The snacks here are tasty, but I wish I could go home and cook. Ratu is tricky to navigate. Look out for some places where you can jump to nearby ledges. I came down here from Kausa, but man, it's such a long way back. I kinda don't wanna go. Just what's so fascinating about Carnival Sick Hits anyway? This place is fucking knocking butts. <laughs> If it weren't for the dorky outfit, she'd be pretty cute. Some boy just went sailing overhead, so the ringmaster's trying to calm everyone down. So, like, does that mean we can go home soon? I was a friend of the ringmaster's family long before she took over. Her, fam her father was really quite the entrepreneur. I got to see her stepping up. And, um, as a result, we just need to assure everyone that Everything is probably okay. We hope. Oh, um, hi. Can I help you? Oh, you're here for the girl. That's great. See, everyone, everything is under control. It was super weird. The girl just sailed over the ride and landed plop in the middle of the circus. And then a moment later, everyone who looked up saw Lloyd fly straight across the circus. We don't know where... We don't quite know where he landed yet. No way, though. The girl survived. Somehow. I don't really know how, to be honest. 
and we'll find the boy too. Huh? You mean it was Terra who? Well, that explains everything. Now we really have to find them or it'll look bad for the circus. Oh, sorry, I didn't properly introduce myself. Hi, I'm the ringmaster of a gate circus. At the gate circus, we bring you the big top, top tier entertainment. It's an experience that can't be bought, guaranteed to make your draw drop. I mean, jaw drop, damn it. Sorry, I'm still new to this. My father was the ring original ringmaster, but he just, well, he's not around. Never mind, Dad. To be honest, we're kind of having a rough time. A gate city has to be closed because everyone who passed through would fall asleep and not wake up. And as such, we can't get any business from a gate or reborn city. It's been tough to keep going, and now Terra's causing problems again. But we will definitely all get through this, okay? Anyway, hey, I had Samson carry the girl into the back of the room so she sh could be treated. I have to finish up here, so go ask him to take her to you. He usually hangs out around the high striker. Oh, there he is. Ice Striker up to go. Win prizes. Or something. Let me demonstrate. Hot! And Wemo! Your power level is... Over 9,000! Not bad, huh? Great. Time for another new bell. Name Samson. Cir uh, Circus Ronda. My Pokemon do most of the work for the main shows, but as you can see, I ain't enlightened. Anyway, you look like you want something. What's up? Oh yeah, that girl? I carried her into the back room just a minute ago. It's on the big top. I'll take you back there. Meet me at the front. Crowd's annoying. Hey, move it! What? What? No oh, shit. After you? So sorry, everyone, but I'm afraid that's all she wrote. Do come back for the, our next show. Oh, Samson. Is this boy you that we, they were talking about? I'm surprised he's conscious. This is. Actually, I forgot to ask their name. Unconscious as always, in the sense of. My name is Ciel. I'm the spotlit starlet of the Agate Circus specialty show. Ariel Ballet is my forte. A pleasure to meet you, darling. Anyway, Shen is here for the girl. Oh, superb. I was worried no one would claim her. Follow me, she's back this way. And here she is. Don't worry, she's well. Miraculously. She's your friend, right? Hey everyone, we got another visitor. Aya! By the way, is something up with Terra? She just ran up, punched her showers, and then scampered off. Aya, can you hear me? Are you okay? Please wake up. Hmm, I feel like shit. Kane? Oh, thank goodness. Been a while. Yeah, sorry about that. How's mom? Shh, don't ask. Where's Hardy? Ah, that must be the other boy who he observed soaring not quite so elegantly over the circus. Hardy was supposed to show me his gym. That's why we went to, up to a gate, but I can't remember what happened when we got there. Something in, something in the city caught the both of you out. It's been closed off since. We found you sleeping in the middle of the street. I almost fell asleep too, but then terror happened. Apologies for her. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. She may be rambunctious, but we do have to keep her around. After all, it wouldn't do for the Agate Circus to lose one of his famous gym leaders. With, Sam Blah. With Samson joining us, we nearly called the Agate Ace Triumvirate. That's right. The gym battles make fantastic shows. Flying Tech Leader, at your service. Terra was the ground type leader, and Samson has nearly joined us on the fighting type. So, very kind of our last leader to retire all of a sudden. 
I've been waiting for this. It wasn't really like that at all. So, Hardy isn't here? Nuh-uh. He probably fell somewhere in Route 2. So then we should go find him. You really seem to like this guy, huh? What? No, it's not like that. I'm just worried, that's all. And I know he would do the same for us, so let's go. Negative, old lady, you sit right down. I'm surprised you can even walk after what Tara put you through. I'm afraid I must agree. It won't do at all to send you in your condition. Shen, would you mind going to look for Harvey? I kind of want to catch up with Aya for a little. I probably owe it to her. <laughs> oh, if you're going to Route 2, you'll probably need a powder vial. You'll see why. We usually have a quite a few people passing through, so we sell them at the front. Then it's settled. Not that I miss him or anything, but please hurry and find Hardy. That's very convincing. I saw you. I saw you perk up at the mention of the leaders earlier. So you're a challenger. Then I should tell you about our special challenge rules. Everyone in their Pikachu would just be challenging the leaders all the time if they could, and then we'd never get to use the big up space for anything else. So, in order to face one of the Ace Triumvirate, you need a special battle pass. We sent some passes out as a promotion, and you also have a chance to win them in, from circus games and other events. So, stick around and get to playing. As you can see, our ad campaign is something else. Oh, shush you. I do hope a gate city is restored shortly. It's such a letdown to see the audience only half full at each show. Unfortunately, no one could quite figure out why everyone in the gate falls asleep. That said, we have to we do have to set one on the case. You won't believe who to either. Turns out Terra the terrible isn't bad with computers. Indeed. She tells us she's able to detect a radio signal broadcasting over a gate city. In just a short while longer, she can figure out its source. Once she does, we'll go in there, give it a good old fashioned knuckle smashing, and call it a day. A highly professional plan, but that is the idea. Hey Aya. You know I'm sorry about pushing all that stuff on you, right? If you were really sorry, you wouldn't have done it. Your heart's beating around the clock. Time's sticking away, it doesn't stop. Evolution has taken place, the world is spinning and changing every day. Anything you think of with a name. There isn't anything in life that ever stays the same. Just stop. Were those stupid songs of yours enough to shove us out of your mind entirely? Of course not. But I made a choice for my own well-being, so there's no point in feeling guilty for it. I didn't mean to saddle you with so much responsibility, but I couldn't deal with Mom anymore. Uh-huh. You think she got any more tolerable after you left? She practically denies your existence now. Her yelling hasn't stopped. The only difference is, is it's not about you anymore. Right. Well, it's whatever. At least one of us can be ha happy this way. And if I didn't have to take your position, I might not have met Hardy. Oh, so he makes you happy, huh? It's not like that. Sure. <laughs> hey, tell me something. What happened to the last fighting leader? I was only told she retired, but your friend seems to know something I don't. She, uh, passed on. Oh. Shit. I look like an ass for what I said. Nothing unusual here. Psh, yeah. But I usually try to hold off on making that known. Shen must have been pretty frustrated to beat the last leader and not get a badge. Oh, you beat them, huh? And when you get around to charging me, I have to amp up the competition. Can't make it too easy. Oh, but you always do. No comments from the super effective peanut gallery. Thanks. <laughs> I may be the peanut gallery. I may be the peanut gallery, but I'm not the one who's salty. <laughs> That's funny. It's not good here for the ship. Don't tell. Wow. That is a strong unknown. Wow.
Ow, 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 ow. Secretly, I am the show. You may hold your applause. <laughs> That's cheeky. Someday I'll get up to see all of them. Hmm. I wonder if they say things different. They change positions. Oh no. So, this hardy guy, I know what you're going to say, and you may as well just not say it. Pshaw, don't be like that. Tell me about him. After all, I'm going to need to know who to beat up if he hurts you. That's what brothers are supposed to do, right? Brothers aren't also aren't supposed to run away from home. Ouch. He's the Gate City rock leader. He came down to help me settle into my new job. You know, the one you totally dumped on me. Okay, okay, I get it. I'm sorry. Put your claws away. You were working on figuring out what kind of puzzle my gym should have. Because I guess every gym has to have a puzzle. Is that strange? As far as I'm concerned, the way to get to your gym is a puzzle. Anyway, he said he'd take me up and show me his gym puzzle as an example. Then this happened. You still haven't told me anything about him. Is he cute? I mean, he... What kind of question is that? <laughs> so he is. I didn't say that. You didn't deny it. That doesn't mean it's true. Is it true? That, I, maybe, use protection. What? <laughs> Great. <laughs> Kane, you're the, <laughs> Kane, you're absolutely hilarious. Some of the clowns are pretty lifeless around here, but there's one that really stands out. She's got rainbow hair, and the whole tent practically shakes when she's around. The strong portion of stores and tents the whole floor is the panel system for the big high striker, and even just the smallest things have some date with trick of the bell. I mean, it's cool to see than to hear the scraps. Do you think CL would get me her autograph? How about a kiss? Nope. Nope. Stupid thing keeps breathing down my neck. Oh, this is supposed to be here. Ah <laughs> oh, man, I don't even want to get up. Can I just sit here, here until the next show? You see all the bars throughout the tent? When Ciel dances, she hangs and moves be between them with using ribbons. It's fantastic. Let's get that powder vial. The powder vial collects and stores various spores from large plants in Route 2. It can hold one use of two types of powder, sleep powder and rage powder. Route 2 is a rocky road, so you'll probably need those powders to help you cross. The Pokemon will be happy to help. With some peaceful coercion. However, there is one flaw. When carrying contained powder, be sure not to shake it too much or it will spoil. As such, try to avoid stepping anywhere with a st stable footing. Got it? But I want to go on it! Oh, right. Ferris wheels out. The Gate Circus uses shards as a game currency. In fact, the entire fair is built on it. Care for a little history? Why not? Years ago, the Ringmaster's father found the Hidden Crystal Valley. He dug up- Oh, that must be Aeolia Valley. So that's why there are so many crystals there. He dug up the crystals and sold some of them to start up the circus. A lifelong dream of this. Then, rather than paying to make golden to token coins like most carnivals, he just decided to use the rest of the crystals as currency. Strangely, we've seen a lot of our shard stock disappearing. I hear people have been melting them down for the chemicals inside? Weird. Come to think of it, I wonder who the circus founder sold all those crystals to in the first place. Oops, this isn't so much of a history as I sent us me thinking out loud. Enjoy the circus! Mmm. Suspicious. I got a super rare kind of ice cream from the vendor. 
We're gonna treasure it forever. Oh no, it's melting! Oops. I've been eating cotton candy for four days straight. That's a go. So route two we are. Shoot, I sprained my ankle jumping across the raw crustle here. <laughs> well, I guess that's what I get for shoving it in into a hole in order to get across, huh? Careful crossing route two. Some stones you can jump are aren't stable. They'll spoil and any powder you're holding. But some people have even fallen. Try your best to avoid and skip rocks, alright? There are two kinds of plants in Route 2. Sleep powder plants and rage powder plants. They're just like the attacks Pokemon use. If any crust will get in your way, either put them up to sleep or round them up and K on them. Throwing sleep powder on a wild Pokemon, you can guess what happens. But rage powder will wake up the sleeping Pokemon and make them attack. Howdy trainer, Route 2 is ahead, and you need a certain eye to go through it. Do you have a powder bar? Oh, you're all set. Then you should be just fine. <sighs> I need a break from hopping across all these rocks. Although I tell you what, I bet that I'm not half as beat up as the kid who was like thrown into the mountain. He landed somewhere in the south part of route. I hope he's alright. There are three mountains nearby, Amatrin, Solacine, and Sigtrin. Which shall I hike today? I'll decide in a battle with you. Ooh. 
Oh no, hair flinch. Oh wow! Well played. You headbutted me into a rock, which did more damage. Wait, or did Outreach miss doing more damage to me? Hmm, better not go to Amatron. I don't think I'm up to that after all. Out of three, Amatron is by far the largest. I'll save that for another day. to get through it. But in the meantime, let's have a warm up. You know, surprisingly, I don't have a gra I don't have a water type. Ow. Ow. Of course you crit me. Good warm up. Let's go. Amateur is basically a massive conglomeration of stone, ice, and water. That's a great challenge. Ah, I see. Okay. I'm supposed to slide this thing up down here. Got it. Oh, right, right, right. I need more powder.
back up. down and come back here. Ah, I see. This is a shortcut way back. I completely forgot. So I basically just made a faster way to get back here. Somewhere. 
There we go. favorite flying types. You won't be able to live on the pit from right you. This is gonna hurt. Alright then guys, I think I'll end the episode right here, um, 38 minutes down. I'll see you guys in the next one.